Well, it's dropped super cold overnight last night. It could be a really difficult day's fishing today. But nevertheless, I'm on my way over to pick up Martin. The gear's loaded in the car. I'm going to fish the slider. I've got the feeder with me as well, just in case. Might have a few chucks out on that and see if there's any bream about. But we're just fishing for small fish today, really, I think. Enjoy this. This is the magnificent Patzel Park fishery. want to talk through the rig that I'm using today at Patzel. Um, as I mentioned the other day in my tackle talk, I've got a, a 14 foot Match Pro, Drenum Match Pro rod, um, paired up with a, a 4000 Legalis reel. And then the rig, as I explained before, is um, a 16 gram Census float, uh, slider float, with a, a pink bead running just behind the float to a 12 gram Olivet which is locked in with some stots, number 10 stots they are I think and about a 30 centimetre gap between there and my swivel and then my swivel's got my hook length attached and in this case it's a 4 pound um, 4 pound end gauge line for my hook length with a 20, it's a size 20 uh, B560 hook so they're, they're a lovely silverfish hook. Um, 20 is probably a bit smaller than what I'd normally use. Probably a 16 would be uh, a more common size for me to use. 
but I think uh, today it's going to be a little bit tough so I'm going to stick with a 20 um, probably fish a pinky or a maggot or something like that and then probably try the worm as well because I think there's normally a few perch around this, uh, this area so see how we get on Well, I think it's safe to say it's been a pretty hard day so far. So we started off um, fishing the slider. I fished the slider for probably about two and a half hours. That's resulted in two very small fish, one little skimmer and one little perch. Probably had about five or six bites to go along with it. Um, Martin, who's on my right hand side here. Martin, how are you getting on? It's the best bite he's had all day. Look, that's a Snickers. Is it was all or Martin's managed to uh, actually drop his rod in today, uh, and he didn't have to do any like uh, diving to go and get it back. He managed to scoop it back up with his landing net, which was uh, probably the most exciting thing that's happened all day so far. Paul, superhero Aldrit, who's on the end peg here, as normal, he's always on an end peg. He's probably Shropshire's best angler for drawing M pegs. He's got a hundred percent record. So Paul's managed to sneak out. Uh, he's managed to sneak out a bream. It's I think it must be the only bream that's feeding in this lake today. And uh, if there's one thing I thought we wouldn't catch today, it was bream because it's been fishing rock hard. So there was a match on here yesterday of. Uh, 12 or 13 people and um, they've had a grand total of three pound win their match um, if I'd have known that we probably wouldn't have come here today to be honest but nevertheless we've had a, a, a decent day's fishing um, it's been nice to get out on the bank we've got some cracking footage as well from uh, Jono's drone so thanks for that Jono, thumbs up click subscribe kid <laughs> um, We'll see if we can sneak a few more out. Talking to the, the lads in the fishing lodge yesterday, um, it, three o'clock it just switched on like a light switch, so we'll see how we get on today. Maybe they'll start feeding in the next couple of hours. We might catch one or two.
to you that it's been a rock hard day here at Patzel today, but nevertheless we've enjoyed ourselves. I've had a lovely day fishing the slider. I've had a couple of small fish uh, and a few bites in between, so it hasn't been too bad. I hope you've enjoyed today's uh, video on, on Patzel. Uh, the drone footage looks pretty good, so hopefully you've enjoyed that as well. And uh, if you're enjoying the channel still, click subscribe. Thanks for watching.